In this video I will teach you how to extract pixel values of points on an image inside Google Earth Engine. Lots of Earth Engine users are having a confusion between sample regions and reduce regions function. Please note that we are talking about an image not an image collection. Technically they are the same thing but reducers gives us more flexibility as compared to just sample regions function. Let me elaborate. Suppose we want to extract just the pixel value of points. I will use the sample regions function. This function will sample band value from the center of each point. But now suppose you have some points that are buffered having some radius of let's say 10 meters. The buffer distance will cover some adjacent pixels on the image. In this case image reducer will help us. If you use the sample regions function it will record the band value of point center. But when you apply reduce regions function and give a reducer for example mean reducer it will now consider mean value of adjacent pixels. By the way I have a separate video in which I explained reducers in Google Earth Engine in detail. Please make sure to watch it link given in description and card above. Let's get to the exercise. I have loaded study area boundary from my assets. Next, I have loaded SRTM image. Then finally I have a points feature collection having one column by the name biomass. The feature collection contains 10 points. First we will use the sample regions function. The sample regions function compulsory arguments include a feature collection. Other arguments in italic are not compulsory. If you don't provide them no error will show. Please make sure to read the documentation of a function before using it as it contains information about with data type does it require and in which form and what it will return in response. Since I want band values of the biomass points inside the feature collection so in properties I will mention it. The properties argument is list of strings. If you don't provide it, the function will extract pixel values at all geometries inside the feature collection. When I print it, in console a feature collection of 10 points is returned having new attribute column of elevation is shown. It means that at all the points now I have value of elevation. To download them as CSV I will have to make a chart. I will generate a feature by feature chart. It requires a feature collection. The X property and Y properties are non-compulsory arguments but for this example I will provide it Y properties is the elevation value that we sampled using sample regions function. Here once again it is a list of strings. I will run the code a chart is generate and the CSV can be downloaded. Now let's use the reduce regions function. It requires a feature collection and a reducer as compulsory arguments. Please watch my reducers in Google Earth Engine video for more information of reducers. When I print it, the console shows that every point now contains a new attribute column of mean. Finally I will plot a feature by feature chart once again, but this time the Y properties is going to be, band mean, as we applied a reducer and the new column added uses the name of reducer. For example min, max, sum, standard deviation etc. Please watch my tutorial on reducers in Google Earth Engine. I will download the CSV once again and compare my results in Microsoft Excel that tells me that they are having exactly the same elevation values. This was the difference between reduce regions and sample regions function. I personally prefer reducers but let me know in comments about your preference. Also to extract pixel values of a time series images watch my charts in Google Earth Engine tutorials series. If you learned something and enjoyed the video please give it a like. Subscribe to my channel for more interesting topics on Google Earth Engine and follow me on Twitter and direct messages are more than welcome. Ask me in comments in case of issues. The code link is given in description. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.